How you doing, guys? Welcome to the HTML Email Developer Channel. Um, I had a subscriber ask me the other day uh, via email. Uh, they were trying to uh, build their portfolio, but they noticed when they were building their portfolio that their code, uh, I'd say their image codes was not showing up. Um, and I had this issue as well uh, when I was trying to um, go on um, uh, and build my uh, portfolio. I noticed I have everything in place, the tables and everything look good and clean, and the images were not showing up. Uh, so I was just dumbfounded, and it took me a while to figure this out. I, actually, I couldn't figure it out. Uh, so I talked to Ivan, you know, Ivan Hurt from uh, his, his YouTube channel. He emailed me back, and he told me that I need to have a place where my images need to be held online. Um, I don't think it works if you don't have it online, but then again, I'm not sure. But if you're trying to build that portfolio and place your images, or your, I mean your email templates online on your website, then you need a placeholder for your for your images. And uh, this also applies to my current position as well. Um, when we are when I'm creating the uh, HTML emails, I have to uh, place my images in this uh, uh, software called Adobe Creative Management. Uh, before I even started trying to implement them into my HTML code. So here's a website, uh, weird name, imgbb.com, uh, imgbb.com, and this is where I um, pretty much stored my uh, my um, images when I was building my portfolio. So what you do is you, you upload your images in here as well in your HTML uh uh, I guess Visual Studio Code or somewhere, or one of those editors. And then you come here and you get the link. Now, I think they changed it up a little bit because you used to could click on it and have and get like several different links that you want to choose from. This is all I could find right here is uh, just a, one link right here. So I'm not sure. Uh, like, again, I haven't been on here in a while, uh, but you can grab this link right here. You copy it and you put it into your uh, HTML code, and that should render your images once you put it up on your website. Uh, so again, uh, this is uh, one issue I had, and uh, I think another subscriber had as well. And uh, I hope they helped them, helped them out. I hope that was at their question. But yes, you have to uh, have somewhere for your images to be online so that they will show up on your website when you put your email templates on your websites. So again, guys, again, this is, like I said, it's a great tool uh, to use, uh, imgbb.com, and again, just go upload your images. Um, you can upload your images right here. Then once you get those images uploaded, you can go in here and you could click on whatever you need. And uh, again, I think they had, they had more links to choose from than now, but now, if not, you just copy this link, put it in your code, bam, there you go. Also guys, speaking of portfolio, I have a new ebook out um, on how to uh, build your email developer portfolio. Uh, it's only $9.99, just like my other book, uh, How to Become an email, email Developer as well. Uh, so it's on the website now. If you go and click on the button that says ebook sales, uh, you will see uh, those two books. But again, uh, I do have a new book. It's called uh, How to Build Your Email Developer Portfolio. Again, guys, please like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Take care.